Hi, my name is Icy Smith. My Chinese name is Dang Sui Feng. I'm Chinese American, but grew up in Hong Kong. About 20 some years ago, I started looking for books on the history and culture of Asian Americans. But I realized that there was not much material out there on that subject, and I wanted to put something together myself. My study in college was journalism, and it was this research that really began my writing career writing little unknown stories and history in the Asian and Asian American community became my passion. I believe it is important to write children's books in different languages and cultural topics because it promotes understanding among people of different ethnic groups and it can create positive social change in the community, country, and our shared world. Most of my work focus on the Asian American immigrant experiences, human rights, and social justice. I recall one day after a school presentation, a Chinese girl came to me holding my book mailing in China City close to her heart, and she told me that she saw a girl look like her in the book and smiled proudly. She said she could read the book in English and with her parents in Chinese. At another school assembly, a Korean-American boy was very engaged in the story and history in Haswin Rise, which is based on true stories of children survivors in the Khmer Rouge regime during the mid-1970s. He asked me many questions on the topic. After the school assembly, his teacher told me that he was actually a shy boy and a reluctant reader. Now, after being exposed to a compelling story, he is more interested in reading. So that made me quite happy. And here is an excerpt of an email from a 10-year-old boy after he read three years and eight months, uh, which is based on true events in Hong Kong during World War II. He said, I'm a 10-year-old boy too, just like your dad was in the book. I can imagine that scary time he and others went through. I try to always keep my mind open so that I can learn from such special people in this world like you and your dad. I'm going to share my book with all of my friends and try to pass on the message of remembering the past. Love, Cooper. These and other little comments that I have received capture the power of multicultural literatures. They serve as a mirror to many immigrant children and a window for everyone to learn multicultural experiences. I salute Dia on the importance of literacy for all children from all backgrounds. Let's celebrate Dia, multicultural and bilingual books. Thank you. Xie xie, Dozet.